Hi, I'm Brad Adams from the HR department, and we're here with Wacky Wednesday, those crazy things that people do in HR. This week, we're going to take a look at fake resumes. According to Professor Stephen Levitt, who is the author of Freakonomics, his research shows that one in two people lie in their resume. Wow! Fake qualifications, fake employers, up graded job descriptions and responsibility, the list goes on. What's next? Is it going to be a letter from mum saying what a wonderful employee little Joey would make? So let's take a look at some of the clangers locally. We've got Marcus Einfeld, former federal court judge with a fake PhD. We've got Glenn Oakley, general manager of Randwick Council on $1.2 million a year. He had a fake MBA from Harvard. And then we've got serial offender, Andrew Flanagan, general manager of Meyer. He had it all, fake qualifications, fake timing, fake job descriptions. He even had a reference from one of his mates. So candidates certainly need to put their best foot forward, but it's up to employers to diligently check those references to make sure they don't make an expensive mistake. I'm Brad Adams from the HR Dept, preventing people problems. Thank you.